This video will show how to create and use patron statistical categories in Sitka's Evergreen. To access the Statistical Categories Patron Editor, go to Administration, Local Administration, Statistical Categories Patron Editor. Statistical categories enable libraries to capture additional information about patrons that is not otherwise part of the patron account. One of the most common patron statistical categories used in Sitka's Evergreen is to track the municipality, regional district, or area the patron falls into. Statistical categories and their values can display in the patron summary in the staff client and in my account in the public catalog. Statistical categories can be used when running reports in Evergreen on your data. To create a new statistical category, click on New Statistical Category Patron. Give your category a name. Keep in mind this name can be visible to patrons. Owning Library will default to the location your workstation is registered at. Multi-branch libraries should change this to their system if they wish to use it at multiple branches. Check the box for required if you wish to require the statistical category for all patron accounts. When this is checked, patron accounts cannot be saved if there's no value entered. Check the box for OPAC visible if you wish the statistical category and value to display in the personal information section of my account in your public catalog. Check the box for user summary if you wish the statistical category and value to display in the patron summary in the patron account for library staff to view. Check the box for free text if you wish staff to be able to enter their own value rather than being restricted to the values in the drop-down list. Support recommends against allowing free text for statistical categories like tax area as it complicates reporting. Check the box for Checkout Archive if you wish the value to be archived in age circulations for reporting purposes. SIP field and SIP format are not currently used by Sitka. Once you have made your selections, click Save. Your new statistical category has been created. You now need to add entries so that staff have values to choose from. To add entries to a statistical category, Click on Entries for the applicable statistical category. Click New Statistical Category Entry Patron. Enter your value. Entry owner will default to the location which owns the statistical category. Click Save. Repeat this process to add all applicable values. Library staff will now see these values when registering or editing a patron. Existing statistical categories can be edited. Select the category you would like to edit and choose Edit Selected from the Actions menu. You can edit the statistical category as needed and then click Save. While you can edit the statistical category itself, you cannot edit or delete the entries for the statistical category. Please submit a ticket to co-op support if you need to edit or delete a statistical category entry. Existing statistical categories can only be deleted if no entries have been applied to patrons. Select the category you would like to delete and from the Actions menu, choose Delete Selected. Click Confirm on the pop-up to confirm that you wish to delete the statistical category. The statistical category is deleted and no longer displays. If entries have already been applied to patrons, you will see the message Delete of Statistical Category Patron Failed or Was Not Allowed. In this circumstance, please contact Co-op Support for assistance. Library staff will see patron statistical categories and their entries in several places. When registering a new patron, the statistical categories display at the bottom of the form. If the statistical category has been set as required, the field will be yellow and must be filled in before the account can be saved. 
library staff can pick the appropriate value from the drop-down menu. If free text is turned on, there will be a second field where staff can enter their text. Library staff will see the same behavior when editing a patron account. If a statistical category has been set to required after the patron was originally created, library staff must fill in a value for it before they can save the patron's account. Once a value has been selected and the account saved, library staff can update the statistical category to use a different value, but cannot remove the value entirely. For statistical categories such as tax area, libraries may wish to include a value like library use, which can be used for accounts where the regular values aren't applicable. If the statistical category is set to display in the patron summary, staff will see both the statistical category name and the value selected in the summary. If the statistical category is set to be OPAC visible, patrons will see both the statistical category name and the value selected in the personal information section of my account in the public catalog. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit the BC Libraries Cooperative website.